Hello family, once again greetings in Jesus name. May you all persevere in faith and hope in things to come. However has it happened to you, Lord has given you promises and it didn't get fulfilled or delayed. Well it happened that promise was given to me and it was not fulfilled in time frame. I was hoping to be delivered and I had wait to wait again. I was before the Lord and as usually praying and pouring out, I heard a voice. I felt in my heart it was father of nations Abraham. I was in unbelief and went to Bible promise. I got positive reading confirming it was him. Father Abraham began speaking. Hello dear one, my dear daughter. Don't be in despair because the promise is delayed. No, he doesn't delay. His promise is on time. We need to have faith of what he is doing. My dear, I was tried and tested too for 25 years. I didn't see any promise fulfilling. I had to hide my pain and sorrow and cheer Sarah all the time. Yes, we were comfort to each other. Still Sarah in her weak moment went another way. Still Lord was faithful to us. He fulfilled what he promised me and Sarah. After the completion of the year, we got the joy in our hands, Isaac. Isaac was a lovely child for me, born in old age. He was precious to me. When Lord asked me to lay him down on the altar, my heart broke again. I loved the Lord more than myself. He was everything to me. Day and night I searched and sought him again. Abraham was known to be healthy, but few know deep down I was living in void. The promise I was looking for was not fulfilling. I was in such a despair I took another way to fulfill it and failed miserably. God's promises are not empty when he says you have to believe, believe in him dear. He is worthy of all praise and glory. He chose you to be His. When you were in the world sinning against Him, still He showed His mercy and continued to do so. My dear, His mercy never stops. Please keep trusting Him. The love He has for you is never ending. When I and Sarah were going through low period, He sent His angels to comfort us. When I and Lord were separated, he sent his word to comfort us. He will never leave us even though you carry a heavy cross for him. We all know what you are going through. So we are cheering on him. Just hold on. Lord is coming to wipe your tears. He did for us. He did for you too. He is with you and never forsake. Whole heaven is cheering on you and pray for you. Humble yourself, sister. Lord is with you. Don't worry, ask us. We will intercede for you. Be blessed and pour out to him. He is there for you. Please tell the world much faith is coming for those who look for him. Those who are in the world will suffer much and keep your eyes fixed on the Lord. Pray to Lord for protection of your families and of your own souls. This time is like no other. Gird up and pray. Many will fall in apostasy. Many will give unto other things for comfort. Many will bow to Antichrist. Many will in despair trying to end their life. But keep your faith in the Lord and trust Him. World is not in order of the Lord. It's chaotic now. Those who are with Him will endure and survive. Those who are not with Him will suffer. Please, my children, sons and daughters, don't turn your back on the Lord. Keep seeking Him until you find Him. He is with you very faithful, very loving and merciful. It's your choice to follow the Lord or the world. Don't give up, sister. Have faith. He will reward you richly. Please do novena to Blessed Mother in faith. You will come through. Tell the flock to do it. Rise up in faith. Even though you feel failing, rise up in faith. That was the end of Father Abraham's message. Family, let's have faith in the Lord and in intercession of Blessed Mother. Seek her and you will seek the help and relief from the Lord. Lord told me to do a novena to Blessed Mother for 54 days for certain deliverances. Her intercession is powerful and will do wonders and miracles in your life.
You can also do Navinas but under the direction of the Lord and Holy Spirit. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Please pray for the channel and share the messages. Be blessed. Thank you.